inakuwa vipi na kuaje maana familia wa together online ni wakati mwingine tena tumekutana tuzungumze kuhusiana na hiki ambacho kinaendelea huko kwenye mitandao ya kijamii. E bwana tuku hapa na video ya Zarze Boss Trade pamoja na mpenzi wake hapa siku ya jana walikuwa club na tunakumbuka uh, niweza kuwaletea pia video ambayo Zarze Boss Trade bwana alikuwa anawaambia mashabiki kuwa wasimfatilie maisha yake eh wasimfatilie maisha yake kama wewe unahisi kuwa Zarze Boss Trade bwana anakukera basi unatakiwa uache kumfuatilia amwani um, follow au um, mbloko kabisa ili usiona kichochote kile ambacho kinamuhusu yeye kwa hiyo anasema yeye yuko happy na maisha yake yuko shwali na maisha yake hataki kuingiliwa na mtu yoyote unaona bwana so inaonekana kabisa Zazi Boswedi kwa huyu jamaa ana ametokea kumpenda sana e, ni kijana ambaye watu wengi wanamuona ni mdogo na nini lakini Zazi Boswedi moyo wake unaonekana uh, umempenda sana sasa tuangalie jamani hapo video alafu Uh, tuone hapa maoni ya watu alafu pia nitawekea pia ile video ya jana ambayo eh, Zaza Boss Red bwana aliweza kuweka na kusema kuwa hataki watu wafuatilie maisha yake. Sasa kama ambavyo tumetoka kuangalia huyu akaja akasema ila huyu hapishani na wema sepeto. E, ni dampo la takataka kabisa. Eh jamani. Huyu akaja akasema uh, mbona kama wanafanya mashindano? Kwa sababu kwamba hata diamond pata mzikaona tu akae kimya. Huyu akaja akasema siku nikijua wewe nani au uh, utakula ngumi wewe sasa sisi uh, unatukompea na wanawake uh, unaleta upuzi hapa. Eh kwa kwamba mimi sipingani na wewe kabisa tukiwa nje anataka tupigane mimi na wewe tukiwa wili chumbani hakuna hata lefa eh uya baka aja akasema kwamba watanzania wote tupo biza na mapenzi la chibaba na chimama wetu jamani ya kaja akasema mimi nitoe humo kwenye uh, supu yenu ya kongoro sawa uya kaja akasema chibaba na chimama ni chi ya kaja akasema kwamba i wanna be this lady Love is a beautiful thing. Enjoy mama T. E, kupendwa raha bwana. Hapa mwingine akaja akasema na waurumia wale watoto wake ni wakubwa sana. Watakuwa wanaona aibu mama yao anachezewa hadharani kiasiki. Lakini Zazi Boss Red anasema watu kama hawa eh nyie inabidi msimfuatilie. Huyu hapa anasema kwamba yani angeiga nyayo za Salome uh, furniture. E, anakula bata e, wala huoni mwanume pembeni. Lile ndo bata laki some na laki starabu yakaja akasema kwamba ingekuwa ingekuwa na damu ni pata mzimungishangilia lakini kwa vile uko na mwingine eti anachezewa do nye wapumbavu kweli yani tuangalie jamani hapo uh, vida ambayo jana zaze boswadi bwana aliweza kuweka na kusema wa mkome am i the only one who loves sleeping in baggy ass t-shirts i love lingerie but i cannot do that like on a sexy something something nights nice, you know like occasional i cannot be like i'm telling you i'm the realist girl here i'm not gonna be wearing lingerie for my men like every fight i want to throw his big t-shirts on and that's what i call sexy anyway guys gonna take you to a beautiful place i don't even know it's in uganda like this place is amazing according to my boyfriend according to him he showed me pictures but it looks like it's out of this world like a mini paradise and it's in uganda i'm like what you kidding me like right here so we're gonna go check it out today stay right here don't ask me for the rest of the footage about last night guess what it went missing if you know what i mean if you know you know so stick around let me get ready and we start this journey today Well, some of you know I'm a very chill person, you know, like I'm very chill until someone presses the button. I'm always chilled. And some of you who've been here longer, you actually know, like I'm good vibes. Um, until somebody presses the button, then I need to air some things out and just clear them.
Sometimes I'm like, you know, let me just get in my DMs and check what are people writing or the comments. And sometimes you find these very nasty comments. If my content annoys you and it really takes the peace out of your life, why are you even following? Why are you here following, leaving very nasty comments? Let me tell you something. I don't even take shit from people that I know in real life. I'm not going to do that on the internet. I quickly add you to my prisoner's list. Do you know where that is? The prisoner's list is my block list. I fucking block. And let me tell you something, because the list is long, even when you come to my Instagram, oh, sorry, and block me, I won't remember you. I just won't remember you. So if you don't like my content, just don't follow. I block. Darlings, you are not forced to watch people's content, okay? I don't understand why you would inflict so much pain on yourself. Like, you don't like a person. But you just wake up to say, oh, what did she post now? What is she up to now? What did she do now? What did she eat? What did she wear? What does her hair and makeup look like? But you don't like the person. Bitch, you are fun. You are obsessed, fun, confused admirer. You just don't want to accept it. You can't be, and let me tell you something about haters, right? They are the first people to check your shit when you post it. They are the first ones. Because they want to keep up. A fan is a fan. They just love you. Even if you posted naked, even if you gave me a wearing rice. Ah, that's my Zari. I just love her. Fans, I love them. Haters, you. Am I the only one who loves sleeping in baggy ass t-shirts? I love lingerie, but I cannot do that like on a sexy something something night, you know, like occasional. I cannot be like I'm telling you, I'm the realest girl here. I'm not gonna be wearing lingerie for my men like every five. I wanna throw his big t-shirts on and that's what I call sexy. Anyway guys, I'm gonna take you to a beautiful place. I don't even know it's in Uganda, like this place is amazing. According to my boyfriend according to him he showed me pictures but it looks like it's out of this world like a mini paradise and it's in uganda i'm like what you kidding me like right here so we're gonna go check it out today stay right here don't ask me for the rest of the footage about last night guess what it went missing if you know what i mean if you know you know so stick around let me get ready and we start this journey today well, some of you know I'm a very chilled person, you know, like I'm very chilled until someone presses the button. I'm always chilled. And some of you have been here longer, you actually know, like I'm good vibes. Um, until somebody presses the button, then I need to air some things out and just clear them. Sometimes I'm like, you know, let me just get in my DMs and check what are people writing or the comments. And sometimes you find these very nasty comments. If my content annoys you and it really takes the peace out of your life, why are you even following? Why are you here following, leaving very nasty comments? Let me tell you something. I don't even take shit from people that I know in real life. I'm not going to do that on the internet. I quickly add you to my prisoner's list. Do you know where that is? The prisoner's list is my block list. I fucking block. And let me tell you something, because the list is long, even when you